Today we are making creepy eyeball soap. These spooky eyeballs will make great party favors and would make a fun addition to your fall Halloween product line. Before we get started, you may want to pause the video here and print the written recipe and ingredient list from the website wholesalesuppliesplus.com. Now let's get started. Creating this product takes six simple steps. Prep, base, additives, mold, package, label. Prepare for the project. Gather the ingredients and equipment. Create a safe workspace that is clean and secluded from children and pets. We recommend wearing protective clothing such as long sleeves, an apron, goggles, gloves, a mask, and a hairnet. First, we are going to make the black pupil part of the eyeball soap. To do this, we will need to cut into cubes one-fourth of the extra clear soap base. Place 1.5 ounces of soap into a small beaker. Heat the soap on low in the microwave until melted. Cut off one-fourth of the matte black soap color cube and allow it to melt into the soap. Gently stir until color is fully dissolved. Pour one inch circles of soap into the bottom of each round soap cavity. Spritz with alcohol to pop any soap bubbles and allow the soap to harden. Next, we are going to make the colored iris part of the eyeball soap. Weigh four ounces cubed extra clear soap to a small measuring cup. Heat in the microwave for 15 seconds or until completely melted. Cut off one fourth of the stained glass ocean blue color cube and allow it to melt into the soap. Gently stir until color is fully dissolved. Whenever you layer soap, you will need to apply a spray of rubbing alcohol so that the layers adhere to each other. When our blue soap is 125 degrees Fahrenheit, spray the black soap with rubbing alcohol and pour the blue soap into a 1 and 3 fourths inch circle. Spritz with alcohol to pop any soap bubbles and let harden. Now is the time to make the white part of the eyeball soap. Cube two pounds of ultra white soap base. Place in a large measuring bowl and melt in the microwave using 30 second intervals of medium heat. Once the soap is fully melted, add one ounce of Crafter's Choice Dragon's Blood fragrance oil and stir until fully blended. When the white soap is below 125 degrees Fahrenheit, spritz the blue soap with rubbing alcohol and pour the white soap into the mold until almost full. Spritz with rubbing alcohol and allow the soap to harden. Spritz the white soap with lots of rubbing alcohol and place the top of the silicone mold over the bottom and securely fasten by pressing the mold halves together. If your pouring soap is hardened, reheat until melted. When the temperature of the soap is below 125 degrees Fahrenheit, pour into the opening on the mold and fill. Allow soap to fully harden. Unmold the soap by pulling the mold halves apart and carefully removing each ball of soap. Trim the soap. If you choose, you can make additional eyeballs with different colors. We liked making pink and green using neon tutti frutti and lemon lime soap color bars. Package the soap in cello bags with pink crinkle paper and curling ribbon. If you plan to sell your eyeball soap, don't forget to add a label to your package. Include the product name, net weight size, directions for use, ingredients in descending order of predominance, company name, and contact information. Share your eyeball soap with others. Give them away as Halloween treats or bring as a hostess gift to your Halloween themed party. You can even start your own business making products like this. Brought to you by Wholesale Supplies Plus, your one-stop shopping destination for quality cosmetic and soap-making materials. For more information or to purchase online, visit WholesaleSuppliesPlus.com.